Hi guys, this is day 12 in my video challenge and uh, today I want to talk about an incident, what happened to me uh, or what happened um, uh, when I was leading uh, the team before that couple came where I was talking about yesterday um, a guy started with me and he was practically there from the beginning and well, as the team was growing I left them alone a bit more and left him in charge he had the orders raised and that's how it works and normally everything would go fine uh, till one day me and the boys that decided to stay in uh, Amsterdam and have a drink and um, we had a boys night out and it's nice uh, it can happen and uh, so I called in, in the morning about 8.30, uh, well, I'm not going to make it to Rotterdam to drive you back and forth. Uh, can you guys take the train? I will refund the tickets. Uh, he said, okay, and um, I started uh, do the math in my brain, and uh, I thought, well, they will take uh, maybe one hour longer, and normally the train from Rotterdam to Amsterdam is about an hour, uh, as much as it's the same with the car, but I gave them, uh, them some slack. So I went back to bed uh, because I had a little hangover. And uh, at 11, I uh, started trying to call them. Uh, all telephones were dead, all in cells. And uh, uh, I was a bit annoyed. So at uh, 11.30, I tried it again. and. Uh, Still no, uh, no sales, and there was a team from my colleague, uh, and um, I asked the, the team captain, you know, can you give me a call when they are there? So, about half an hour later, still no team, and at 12, still no team, so I told the other key, the team captain, well, if they are there, can you give me a call, and uh, tell them to start right away, because... Um, uh, uh, normally we would drink coffee in the morning and uh, uh, take it a bit, bit easy the first half hour but uh, well I thought uh, they had time enough to take it easy and at one o'clock uh, I finally got that call and uh, the team captain from the other team said John uh, they are there but they are drinking coffee and I said why uh, didn't you tell them uh, um, to start right away and by that time I was boiling. Um, steam came out of my nose and ears because uh, for two reasons. Uh, first, <laughs> they took about three hours to get from uh, Rotterdam to Amsterdam, which is bullshit. Um, and second, they left out of fun. And third, uh, I told the other team captain that I said, and uh, they should start away, should start right away. So I asked the team captain to give the phone to the other guy, and I started shouting at him so loud that my mouth was coming through the horn, and everybody could hear me putting this guy in his place. And uh, a little later, I went to the um, to the place where where they were uh, promoting and. Uh, I started apologizing for doing that because I shouldn't have do, done that uh, in public and um, it was okay and uh, we talked about it and it was over uh, and one week later he resigned because yeah, he lost face and that wasn't what I wa wanted to happen because he was a nice guy, he did his work normally as he should. And uh, I still think, well, I should have asked him why his phone work was out and why uh, he was so late, but I didn't even bother to. I was only angry. And in a way, later, um, it had a plus too because nobody got it in his brain to. Uh, to, to pull a stunt like that later and uh, everybody had a certain amount of, uh, well, I, I won't say fear because I, I wasn't like that normally and uh, I never lost my temper to people and if there was something I didn't like I would uh, ask them for a conversation in, 
in private and then I would tell them what I thought of a, of a matter and, and never in public. Uh, but this time I didn't and uh, I regret that because you can be angry with somebody but um, there might be a reason for it. Well, I still wouldn't know why they put out the telephones but uh, um, there was, um, yeah, I, I was wrong doing that and, and um, I regret my actions and um, I think that as a person you should always listen to the other why he does something and well, the reason I told this, I thought about this team and uh, I wish I uh, had the same guys r right now because they were amazing and also this guy was also a good worker and uh, um, having done, done that to him, well, that must have really hurt and uh, I think somebody else's feeling is, isn't right or even if it's uh, about work or money and everybody deserves respect even if they do stupid things. I, I've done mine and believe me uh, they were a lot. So uh, this way I want to apologize again to Martin because uh, he didn't deserve uh, uh, my putting him in his place uh, where others were at. I did it in his face 100 times uh, and I did it also um, um, a lot of times uh, that I uh, told him that I was sorry about that and I, and I, I shouldn't have done that but um, yeah um, I lo lost a good friend and a good worker because uh, of me uh, being angry and uh, something like that would not happen to me again in my life that is, uh, <laughs> that is a problem ok guys uh, have a good day out there and uh, a lot of success.